guys, welcome back. <laughs> so for today, I'm going to talk about 10 of my favorite products that are under about $25. Um, I'm definitely not willing to pay over like 20 really, unless it's a product that I really, really, really like. Um, like, especially if I don't like the product, for me there's no use to have it. Especially if it's over a certain amount of money that I'm not willing to pay for. I will attach the links below where I got them from. And then you guys, you know, if you want to use them, you can get some yourself. <laughs> also, iced pumpkin latte with almond milk. It's delicious. Ask me why I've been on a pumpkin kick because I don't know, I didn't drink any pumpkin at all last year. Also, ask me why I was on, pin, like, I was with my friend today and I go to Pinterest and I, like, because I always get, like, random notifications and I had a message. I was like, who sent me a pin? And it was some guy trying to slide into my DMs via Pinterest. Weird. I know. Okay. Um, so I'm going to go over the products that I love so much and I use continuously. Probably. Yeah, I use at least all these products, uh, at least daily, depending on when, like, I need them, but at least weekly they're being used. So, for my number 10 product, it is the beautiful Carmex. Um, Carmex is my favorite chapstick because it is the medicated form, so it actually feels like it's doing something to my lips and actually making it stay, not, um, dry. And I really like it because I can actually go throughout the whole night without then my lips feeling like they're trapped when I wake up. So, A plus for Carmex. And I get Carmex from the dollar store. And it's a dollar. Which is really nice. Or I'll go to Target and I think I got it $3 maybe. So it's still basically a dollar for one of these which is really nice. Because chapstick should not be more than a dollar, okay? You lose them, and they go away. And you go through them really quick, too. Especially when it starts getting to that colder time, and you're starting to need it more a lot. For my ninth item, it is these three prong clips. Like that. I stole these from my mom. I'm not entirely sure the brand or how much they did cost her. But I think she got a pack of probably, like... 10 maybe of like there's like different colors too and these are really nice because I have the shorter hair and it like always will fall so then when I put it up I'll just like tag them like this and then it makes it a lot easier and my hair doesn't float out as much which is really really nice for my seventh product I have the Mario Badescu um the drying lotion so this I actually haven't used it in a while, but when I, I love to use it when I get, um, like, spots on my face, like pimples and stuff, and it's just, like, one that won't go away, like, the scar, and, like, I need it to go away the next day, I will just take a Q-tip, you, like, get the pink sediment at the bottom, um, with a Q-tip, and then put it where you need it, and then wash it off in the morning, and normally it's either, it's, like, almost gone or gone, which is really nice, especially when, like, I'm in a hurry to get it to get it to go um sometimes it'll take two days it just depends on like how bad the spot is so the Mario de Badescu I actually got in a pack for Christmas of like the three uh, scent sprays and then this okay so it retails for $17 whether you get the plastic or the glass this one just happens in the glass because it's what came in the pack um I probably would just get plastic though because I have a habit of dropping things and breaking them congratulations to me for my sixth product it is good old Meissler water so I actually found out about Meissler water from my roommate slash sorority little Emily I met her a few videos ago and she just had it and I was like hmm, that seems kind of nice to clean your face with so what I like about this is it's all-in-one waterproof, um, removes makeup, even waterproof mascara, cleanses, and soothes. No rinse, harsh rubbing for your face, lips, and eyes, and it's for all skin types, especially even the sensitive ones. Um, and my face anymore has become, like, a lot more sensitive, which is really, which is really annoying, actually, but it's fine. 
But what I like about this is that I'm not using a makeup wipe and like pulling at my face. I'm just able to use like one of those like cotton, um, I use like the cotton circles. I'll pour it on there and I'll even, I'll just like take it off. I also don't wear a lot of makeup so it, I only use like one cotton swab and not really a lot of this. But I think I got, I believe that I got these little bottles because I got two of them. I believe I got them from Ulta for like $3.99. Um, but next time I'll probably get the bigger bottle just from like Target or Walmart or something. Just so then I have the size that I would get would be $8.99, which is like the size bigger than this, so 13.5 ounces. But for the purposes of I need, I don't wear makeup a lot, but when I get a job and I will be wearing makeup a lot more, so this would be really nice to have. Um, and these little bottles are nice because then you can take them easier when like you're going, you can just throw it in your purse. Or so the Flamingo, I think I paid, I think I got like five cartridges and I paid like $8.99 for the cartridges. And then I want to say that the shave gel was $4.99 and the razor itself was, I don't remember offhand. Flamingo Foaming Shave Gel has aloe vera in it, which is really nice and keeps it nice and soft. And then, like, these actually get you a while. I think I've gotten four shades out of them. The only thing I don't like about it is that, like, the top white piece gets, like, really dirty and gross quickly. That's annoying, but I like the price of it. And I actually got a compliment when I was getting a pedicure a few weeks with my mom. The lady doing my pedicure was like, your legs are really soft. And I thought maybe it was my lotion, but then thinking back, it was definitely this because I just shaved my legs that day before. So it does get you really nice and soft when you are using this. And especially because like I get really dry skin really easily. So this is really nice to have. And I'm really enjoying it. I haven't had to get any refills with this. And I think this came with two cartridges. So I had to get like another refill. But again, I'm finally I'm fine paying $8.99 for, for five refills. So for my fourth Oh, last one was a sixth one. I'm bad at math. Please ignore me. So, for my fifth products that I use religiously, I have super curly hair. As you can tell, I got this using product, though. Because if I don't, it's going to be atrocious. And I don't want it to be atrocious. So, I have been using Not Your Mother's Smooth Moves Frizz Control Hair Cream. And then I will add on the layer of the Not Your Mother's Kinky Moves Curl Defining Hair Cream. And it smells so good and the mix together is amazing. And I can get like two hair wares normally out of this product. I've been mixing it with another product but I'm not sure how I feel with that one yet. So I'm not going to add that one to this yet. But maybe as time goes I can tell you if I am liking it yet because with my hair specifically I have to make, I have to use it a few times before my hair figures out if they like it. Makes no sense but it makes sense to me so I'm going to go with it. But I really like this one. This one does do like the frizz control and then this one does help keep it nice and curly. Which I need because I can't just go with no product. Curly hair probs right there. <laughs> my fourth product. I have found, I have found not a lot of brands of lipstick that I like. And the one brand that I'm obsessed with is Drew Barrymore's line Flower. This is the nude blush color. I don't know if you can see it. I don't, also don't want this to focus out on my face. I hope this didn't just focus on my face. So the one thing that I really love about this is the wand. Because the type of wand that it is, it's flat on both sides. And then it gets you like, I, I don't know, personally I feel like that gets a more even distribution. But the formula itself is really nice because it goes on smooth, goes on soft. And the color is nice, but this is like my go-to color just because I can wear it with anything. And it's easy to put on because it kind of blends in. This is definitely something I'll like wear when I go to work. And it's even what I wear when I go out. So for my third product. So with like my hair products, which I actually kind of forgot to mention before, I try to use stuff that are like more natural, have like no sulfates, no parabens. And I even like use that with 
regular products that I'm using. It basically sulfates aren't good for your hair. That's what it is. It makes it so your hair can't breathe. So that it won't really grow. So one of the products that I found, and it actually is like curl specific, is Pacifica Pineapple Curls. And of course, I'm also obsessed with pineapples. It was my camp name. I literally have pineapples all over my room. So I instantly was like, oh my god, I need to get this. But also, like, it's really cute packaging. But I use the shampoo and the conditioner. Um, they both are formulated without sulfates and silicones. That's what it is. The silicones can't make your hair breathe. Um, then it's also 100% vegan and it's cruelty free. And that's one of the other, thing I, other things that I have been doing with my products lately is making sure that it is cruelty free. Um, so I'm yeah, obsessed with this Pacifica brand and I will even find like other things for Pacifica that I like. So this, my final two were really hard to choose because I'm obsessed with both of these brands just in general. But, but my second product is in general just like this brand, but Raw Sugar, the body butter. I get really dry elbows so badly. Actually, I need to put some of this on right now because my elbows are so dry still right now. But I put this on like my elbows and my skin and it actually like works. And I haven't been able to find a lot that actually do work. But it's like, I mean, you can even see when I do this. It's like you don't even need a lot of it. Like I have this much and it's going to cover like my elbow and then more. Because like I'll... Like, it is so nice, and it's so smooth, and it's not in, it's a little bit greasier than I was hoping for, but still not as bad, like, once you really rub it in, like, once you get it really rubbed in. And this is the lemon scent, the lemon sugar scent, and I'm, like, obsessed with this lemon scent. I don't know why I'm just obsessed in general with lemon smelling things lately. I don't know if it's, like, a summer thing or what. So, in general, I'm just becoming really obsessed with this brand. So then, um, the other thing that I absolutely love about this product is when you buy something, then they're going to give something back. Best favorite brand is a mascara, and I already have, like, naturally long eyelashes, so I really don't need mascara, but I like to still put it on because it still, like, adds in another definition of layer to my eyes, and about two years ago, I used the Ipsy brand. And I actually got it in there. So, so I still have the sample size. And please don't drag me be gurus. But I've had this for like two years now. No, just a year. Okay, anyway, either way, please don't come for me. I just don't wear makeup enough. And I'm not going to throw something away if it's still being useful to me. But it's called Thrive Cosmetics. I am obsessed with this brand. Um, and the cosmetics is... C-A-U-S, like cause. This is also cruelty free. Another thing that I love. But it's called the Liquid Lash Extensions Mascara. And I literally will put on one layer. And it's like I've just put on four layers of mascara. So I haven't actually had to go get the big brand yet. Like the big tube yet. I'm sure it's coming sooner rather than later. Because I haven't started wearing makeup a lot more. Um, but the Big Tube does retail for, I believe, $24. The only bad thing about this is that you can only get it online. So then obviously you have, like, your shipping stuff too, which is annoying. But this is the only product I think I will pay over $25 for. Over $20 for. Because all my other products are definitely under $10. So, like, definitely. Like, all my products that I have are reasonably priced products that I enjoy thoroughly. And that I will not give up for sure. So I hope that this video was useful to you guys and that maybe some of these products you guys can start using. So let me know in the comments what you guys think if you want to see more stuff like this where like I do show you more products that I use. Um, but these are like the main products that I do use. I use a lot of other products. I mean it's not for my makeup. And yeah. So. What am I looking at? Oh, I didn't know it was going to be my video. Okay, he hates me. Yes, it's a dumb video that I don't agree with. Okay, I'm telling my viewers about the products I use that are under $20. And I'm saying how fun this video is. Huh? No, look, I'm hey, doing work. Hey, go do some work. I am doing work. Okay, I can't see you. <laughs>